is it important to you personally? Local music scenes, you know, stuff yeah. like this going on. It builds a sense of community, not just among artists, but among everyone. Uh, the whole DIY thing is like a good way to collect ideas and mostly not everything, but progressive ideas. And this is like a feeding ground for new ideas and like what is okay, like standards of living. And the community is so like welcoming and loving and 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 you can just really like thrive in that community. You know, it, it's a wonderful place for creative minds of, of, of every walk of life. What it means to me is that it's accessible to everyone and accepting of everyone. That way, like, no one gets left out and everyone feels involved because that, like, there's a lot of music scenes that don't really um, perpetuate that ideal a lot. And this, they do in Worcester. Worcester does it, Lowell does it, Amherst does it, but Worcester does it really well. And there's a really strong scene here because of that. I think that as human beings, we strive for a sense of belonging. Um, amongst other people. And what's really great about the space and the community here and the bands that play around here is that they're very aware of this and it's a very collaborative community which creates an even bigger sense of community, which creates a bigger sense of belonging, which creates just this like really fuzzy, great feeling uh, that then permeates through like really good music and really great bands going on tour and like talking to each other and making more friends and building this huge DIY network uh, that no longer is just a music scene in Worcester but is actually like expanded and expansive across the US. My name is Noriyoshi Wagabaya Shinjiro. Um, I'm 15 years old. Um, uh, I started maybe throwing shows like four years ago, and um, I've never had the cops called on me. <laughs> so I get fun a lot. All I do is sober shows, and then they get 11. Nice. The best formula you can get. I feel like everyone here is like very like close to each other. And everyone comes out here and supports bands, and they bring money, and they like put in, and they, like, and they know where the money is going. I think that's very important. And like support touring bands and support like local musicians. And I feel like that's what like the DIY scene should really be about. And performing like this is a way that we build community. It's a way that we like have music together, and like a way that I express myself that like is fun. And like being here is great. You just make friends. You meet people. You see what everybody else is doing, and it allows you to like blow up creatively and like express yourself like to the fullest. Maybe not to the fullest, but your life gets fuller when you're able to meet people, friendly people. I love it here, I love playing here, like, I love Worcester so much. Like, after a band like finishes playing, I always like stick out my hand and I'm like, great sad man. Yep. And like, that feeling is pretty cool. And uh, you know, I mean, we've just met a lot of people and I've like, been kind of like a shy person my whole life and I've never met so many people as I have like going to DIY shows. The DIT like do it together because like you can't do anything alone. There's so much heart in the Worcester scene and I feel like there's so many great musicians but we don't have quite as much of the name. You know Worcester I feel like could could be on that same level because we have some some really really awesome musicians and and the heart is definitely there. I feel like people just need to to hear about it. You know, we just need to start getting eyes turned towards the city because the, the scene here is just one of the best that I've ever encountered.